All right, well, finished episode four or three, so we might as well just move right into four since I have time. I've already set it up. Should be good to go here. What the? Well, this window's bigger than the other ones. Hold on. I must have picked a larger uh, setting than normal. Hmm, wait a second. Let's see something here. Does the game look better like that? Oh, I picked standard. Whoops. No, the quality doesn't really go up higher. Okay. We'll turn it down to this, because then it gives me more more screen real estate. Alright, just double checking everything's running okay, and we're good. Full screen mode off, graphics quality high, hints medium, all this is the same as before. Matt, Matt, have I got a story for you? Let's Matt, have I got a story for you? Let's start at the beginning. Saveload. New game. Save and load, boys. You hold the man. Settings. Settings, baby. Staying dressed doesn't know the meaning of the word quit. Or a dumbrate. A dumbrate? I quit, Commissioner. S scenes from the next episode. Scenes. 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 Settings, baby. Settings. Man, have I got a story for you. All right. Let's start at the beginning. Tutorial here is exactly the same again, but I've noticed that Strong Bad actually wears the glasses that he wears normally in this chapter. Anyway. Dangerous 3. Dangerous Carter. So in the context of Strong Bad emails... Uh, there is a danger. There was Dangeresque Two, and then after that came Dangeresque One, subtitled Dangeresque, comma T O O Two, and uh, Homestar is Dangeresque Two. I always knew it would come to this. If that's confusing, Did don't worry. It's think supposed to be. I wouldn't find out. Did you really believe that I would never discover the true face of my greatest enemy? That's right, but it doesn't matter now because I have the diamond! You mean this diamond? Yes! Oh, that actually kind of, uh. took me by surprise there. Well, this immediately wins points for being the most stylistic of the four, of the episode so far. What? What? Oh yeah, right. Reply to all. Dear all the annoying morons that have been bugging me about it for four and a half years. Yes, I finally finished Dangerous Three. The criminal projective. So you can all eat it. The critics are stark raving. A dastardly, masterly masterwork of cinemagic wonder. More special effects than a Jessica Tandy joint. They may give you the whole tub of popcorn, but you'll only need the edge. Why? Tickets are selling for like a hundred dollars a piece. Everybody who's anybody that gives me a hundred bucks is going to be there. Oh crap, I'm late for the premiere. Hey, Rathikins. Remember this being a website using Flash? Yep. This was like THE Flash website for a while. Where have you been? Hey, we've been Finally, I hear it. Stop the movie. Okay, peoples. Here is the moment you have all been waiting for. The long-awaited premiere of Dangerous 3! 3! 3! 3! Yeah? Well, I don't care what the FBI, CIA, RGB, and XFL say. Wow, then that's I dated. That's a dated reference right there. The XFL. 
Stranger S plays by his own rules. I like the the duck grabby. It's 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 a scoot. It's scoot. Oh, how did those get there? I thought sure I returned these priceless paintings that were evidence. It's ah, a scoot scooper. Suckers. These paintings really tie the room together. These belong. Oh, how did those? Oh, what do you say? This damn it! I thought it was gonna be these two. These belong in a museum, but I'm keeping them anyway. It belongs in a museum. Keep on doing your swing thing, lamp. Keep on. Hello, commissioner. Do what to a rabbit? You got the wrong number, pal. I'm not in that business anymore. I'm not doing that again. Stupid that burned. Stupid telemarketers. Hello? Uh, oh, hey! No, it no, it didn't even ring. Yeah, I know. That's so weird. So, yeah. Hey, can I call you back? No, I just... Yeah. Yeah, I'll call you back. I just gotta... Yeah. 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 Okay. Yep, I will. Okay. Bye. What? Oh, okay. Give your mom a hug. Okay, bye. What just happened there? Hello? Commissioner? Stupid. Let me just check the dangerous database to see if any new important missions have come in. One email. Algar bullet catching. Dear Dangerous, have you ever caught a bullet with your teeth? Cause that would be awesome. Just wondering, Algar, worthless agent. <laughs> of course I can catch bullets with my <clears throat> teeth. You learned that on like the first day of basic training at Crooked Cop Academy. You also learn how to mess with your superior officers in hilarious fashion and make cool noises with your mouth. <laughs> Oh, I can also catch bottle rockets, musket shot, heat sinking missiles, Must and rusty pennies that have been thrown off skyscrapers. And I'm currently working on my yellow belt and catching throwing stars with my eyelashes. Wink, wink. Deleted! <laughs> Man. That city is so at large. And I have a great view of Brainblow City's majestic... Brainblow, that's a nice name. Man, that's... Nunchuck gun. Oh, that's what he mentioned uh, in the last episode. Nunchuck gun. The only gun that's never out of ammo. Trinket. Oh, broken half of a paperweight. You were the last thing my father ever gave me before he left. And the only thing I have to remember him. Of course, I might not remember him as such a cheapskate if he bothered to give me something that was whole. Alright, that's so what I got. The nunchuck gun and the trinket. We got a special map, like in episode 2, office, which is apparently in Europe. 12 collectibles, 7 costumes, 14 characters to nunchuck, 6 characters to celebrity name drop, one of which I already got. Out and Spit takes 13. There's a mini game and no teen girl squad here. Dead informant. Dangerous three merchandise, space circus manual pages, personalized bullets. Bullet. Yeah, I should probably answer that. All right. Probably a gorgeous dame in desperate. I'm crack open another house. snack. I know it's two days in a row, but it's been a while. Why, hello, beautiful. And I could afford to. Uh... Hello, dangerous. It's me, Ronaldo. Your partner. I'm here with your on again, off again, sometimes other partner with the same name as you. Danger ask two? The big D. Are we late for the. Uh. What's my line? Retirement party. Oh, yeah. Retirement party? Diet Brown. You know, because I retire in two weeks, and then I'm off to spend my days in the Sidekick Islands. Where nothing can possibly Again, so much dialogue that, like, I don't mind I'm taking okay. a snack break while this is going on. Ronaldo. 
That's not the color of brown you'd like. You dye it brown. I hope I didn't just do something because I accidentally hit the uh, keyboard with my jack links. No, it looks fine. Okay. Now that you're retiring, old man, you won't have to make up excuses for being so grossly out of shape. Yeah, now I can accentuate this little bundle of blubber on the beach by lathering it up with sunblock and cocoa butter. That's an image I didn't need stuck in my brain. Now that you're retiring, old man, you won't have to make... Yeah. That's an image. So, Ronaldo, you're finally retiring. I guess it's a good thing to get out now before your skills degrade as much as your looks have. I like how the camera's got that. Wait for that, danger -esque. My skills took a turn for the worse like, long before my looks like faded. Like over-exaggerated oh, movie so movement. that's movie. why you don't dance no more. How are you enjoying your retirement party? I can't believe that in just two weeks I'll be leaving this orphanage for the last time. I can't believe that in just two weeks I'll finally be able to get that baloney smell out of here for good. What? I thought you liked the smell of my deodorant. Tucking lunch meat under your armpits does not deodorant make, Ronaldo. But it does provide a healthy snack for later. How are you enjoying your retirement party? A delicious snack. I Maybe not healthy. What? I thought you... Tucking lunch meat under... What do you make of this broken half a piece of junk? Boy, that looks real familiar. Like something your dad had before. It looks like a toe. You think it's a toe? Sure. What do you make? What? Sure. Diet brown. All the fizzy with none of the flabby. Yeah, if I'm gonna hit the nude beaches on my retirement cruise, I need to start watching my girlish figure. It'll work even better if I just take it away. I'm confiscating this. Official corrupt police business. Ah, oh, sweet. I get the can of brown. I get to drink it. No thanks. Dangerous doesn't drink any ones that aren't designated as cold, frosty, or tall. What do you make of this? Maybe this thing I occasionally use as a doorstop is actually expensive, illegal Colombian chocolate. Or maybe not. He's not thirsty. Trust me, I'm detective-esque. I know these things. But who doesn't- who isn't up for a good can of Diet Brown? He's not thirsty. <laughs> what is in this cake? My favorites, bologna and olives. Oh, so it's, so it's olive loaf. Me one every year for my birthday. So it's just olive loaf, then. And yet, you lived long enough to retire. I think I better stay away from that thing. And probably classify it as a biological hazard. Take Diet Blue. Diet Pepsi Blue. I used to love Pepsi Blue, and I forgot it was a thing for a long time. No, I didn't think we forgot it was a thing. I thought it was just gone. Like, they stopped making it, and then they suddenly brought it back a few years ago. I'm not using that on myself. Besides, I probably <laughs> wouldn't even feel it. Pe Pepsi Blue first showed up when Vanilla Coke did. And I remember for a while, I was like, oh man, these are both so good. And then they both went away. And now apparently they're both back. <laughs> I never get tired of that. Freeze! Oh uh, yeah? You wanna get crazy? Oh, I'll get crazy! Nope, that's too crazy for me. Hey, you gotta teach me that killer spin kick move you do. What are you talking about? You know, when you kicked killing you guys bunt that last time. No, you must have dreamt that. But yeah, I could probably teach you. Hey, you gotta t You know. No, you- You've been screwing up a lot in the past a lot lately. I don't need a loose cannon on this He's been team. screwing up in the past a lot. Back off, buddy. I don't want to be here any more than you do. 
but I'm the only one you got. Hey, hey, hey! Save that kind of banter for the racquetball court, you two! You've been screwing up a lot in the past a lot lately. Hey, you've been screwing up a lot in the past a lot. He's been fucking up the macaroni. Hey, hey, hey! I can't believe Ronaldo is retiring. I know. He's taken my badge away 13 times. Good thing I bought a case of them. He only took mine once. But then I just stole yours since it already says Danger Escon. Check this thing out. Wow, what is that thing? Well, what do you think it is? Hmm, is it animal or mineral? Mineral. Heavy or light? Kinda heavy. Sweet or salty? If I were to venture a guess, salty. Then I have solved your riddle. The doctor is his mother. Yeah. Never mind. I guess after Ronaldo retires, I'll have to start looking for a new regular partner. What do you think Ronaldo's replacement's gonna be like? Streetwise loose cannon with nothing to lose? Book smart stuff short with something to prove? Foot long hot dog in a Kaiser roll? Oh wait, I forgot. After Ronaldo retires, I work alone. Maybe it'll be me. I'm a trash talking rebel with- It won't be you. <laughs> I can't believe Ronaldo. I He only took my- Check this to- Man. Heavy- Never mind. Huh. Oh, I'll get. Oh, I'll get the door. <laughs> Dangerous. Cutesy buttons. Are you here for Ronaldo's retirement in two weeks party too? Nope, I'm here because I need your help to save millions of helpless rainforest trees. Like this one. Marzipan, I told you not to bring your stupid plant! Credence is a natural movie star. He deserves to be in this movie. Anyway, Light him on fire. I'm here because I discovered the location of a secret formula that will save the rainforest. But it's located deep in the jungles of strong Borneo. For me, that's far too dangerous. That's without an apostrophe. Not dangerous. Dangerous. What do you say, guys? One last case as a team? Just for all this movie's sake? You bet, dangerous. We'll just grab the formula and come back. What could possibly go wrong? Sorry, buddy. I can't. I've got, uh... Something else. I have to keep my eye on today. You guys go on without me. Hmm. Let's get moving to Strong Borneo for our last case together. Well, Dangerous 2 left the party in quite a hurry. The two? What do you think he's up to? Oh, maybe he's planning a surprise party for my retirement. We just had your retirement party. You did? What a surprise! Well, dangerous. Ooh, we just had. You did? Cutesy buttons. That's a fitting name for you. Thanks, dangerous. You think I'm cute? No, I think you smell like old buttons. Oh, are those supposed to smell bad or something? Cutesy buttons. That's a fitting name for you. Thanks, dangerous. You think? No. Oh. Who cares about your stupid rainforest? The only thing the rainforest ever did for me was give me wet splinters. The rainforest provides us with oxygen so you and I can breathe. It's like our planet's lungs. Well, those lungs better start smoking if they want to be as cool as dangerous. Damn. Who cares about your stupid? Well, have you met my partner, Ronaldo? He's my partner. Well, until he retires in two weeks. Yup, and I'm totally not gonna be shot at, whacked in the head, shoved off buildings, or blown up in any way before then. Yeah, he's nice only two weeks from retirement. You, he's fine. 
Does something smell like old cold cuts? Ah, uh, you're too kind. To be fair, they're not too cold anymore. Ronaldo's gonna be helping out on your case. Anything he should know? Only that the formula is extremely delicate. You must be very careful not to handle it too rough, or it could be destroyed. Oh, Ronaldo won't be touching it. He's all thumbs. That's me. We'll leave the delicate stuff up to these precision instruments. You know what? You know what Coach Z makes me think of? Have you ever seen home movies? That, uh, that Brendan Small show before he did Metalocalypse? All the kids in that show, their clothes were just like, their clothes were just like full body suits. Like their hands, their feet, they didn't have shoes. They just wore like a single piece of clothing that covered their hands and feet. And that's what Coach Z makes me think of because he's got like that same single body like look to him. Excuse me, had a burp there. This formula, tell me more about it. In my research, I discovered an ancient civilization that had accidentally created a formula that had the power to save the rainforest. At the time, the rainforest had no natural I think it was just the art style of the show. Except for giant robot dinosaurs. Wait, are you serious? Interesting. Yes, go on. <sighs> so the formula was hidden away in a safe but dangerous land, and you were the only one brave enough to get it. Yes, that is true. Good thing I bought some hollow point anti robosaur rounds for my nunchuck gun. Where do I find that formula again? Deep in the tropical jungles of Strong Borneo? Strong Borneo, of course. I'll assemble a landing party and we'll set out within the hour. Have you met my part? Yep. It's. This. Hey, cutesy. Ever seen anything like this before? Hmm, my sister and I both have lockets that look kinda like that. They're two halves of- It's not a dumb girl's locket. It's some kind of cool guy thing that my father left for me. I bet if you get it wet, it transforms into a cool sports car with built-in fishing tackle and batting cages. Hey, cutesy. Ever seen- it's not a dumb girl's locket. It's some kind of cool guy. If you get it wet, it turns into a key that you could use to unlock half of uh, Metal Gear Rex. Thank you, Snake. Now the detonation codes are complete. The moody lighting and smoky atmosphere are being brightened too much by this plant. Maybe I should take it out for some fresh air and water. Okay, he is looking a little pale in here. Perhaps some sunlight would do him good. Two thirds, actually. Yeah. Well, because you need the you need the neutral key as well. Was it three keys in in Metal Gear Two? Yeah, it was. Because you could turn it into the ZL emblem, the Zanzibar Land emblem, and then you could turn it into two other things. I still have your plant. You better not do anything to harm Credenza. I'm keeping my eye on him. Yeah. You do that. Uh, my workplace manual describes that as inappropriate behavior. Despite that, I'm still not giving them my plan. So just today, just before the stream started, uh, my, uh, I just got notification that my, uh, my, my, uh, my Intellion plush has shipped, which I completely forgot about. I knew it was coming out this year. I didn't think it, like. They were like, oh, it ships in January, and I'm like, yeah, it's the end of January, it's not shipping this month. But, uh, apparently it is. So I'll be getting that in a, in a bit. Diet Brown, are you trying to tell me something? Of course not, Dollface. At least, not anything the stitching Big, on yes, it is big. It is, told you. it is just under four feet tall. It's, it's not wide, because Inteleon's a very thin Pokemon, but it's a very tall plushie. Sorry, I had to do something real quick here. I'll pause the recording for just a moment. And I'm back. 
Meowdy sour cream. You, you're burnt out. Oh, are you working hard? Taking a lot of commish. Commish. Freeze! Hey, don't point that thing at me. Lucky thing you're my meal ticket, lady. I'll spare you this time. This time. All right, let's get out of here. The treacherous jungles of Strong Borneo. Let me just mark that location on my super high-tech global being satellite. Being a dumbass and what's not I mean, that's what happens. Let's put it right here, in the middle of nowhere. Gonna do it? No, come on. If you're getting burnt out, rest. Don't do. Oh, okay. I just gotta pull a gun out on everyone. Don't, don't push yourself too hard because you're gonna get tired. You're gonna get, you're gonna hurt your arm or something, and then you're not gonna want to do it anymore. All right. I think we've more or less got to where we need to be right now. To Strong Borneo. So here we are. Braving the rapids of this turbulent river deep in the heart of the jungle. Gangs of angry street piranhas circle beneath us. Cannibals and volcanoes close in from all sides. And behind us, just out of view, is the 300-foot jaggedy waterfall from which we just safely dropped. Boy, am I glad you beat up that weightlifter ex-Navy SEAL we had for a guide and decided to captain this boat yourself. Your quick thinking and superior skills are the only reason we survive! True, but we aren't out of the bow yet. Now we are out of the bow. Okay, according to this map, the formula should be around here somewhere. Look around, Renaldo, but don't touch anything. Don't touch anything. Alright. Don't touch anything! Sorry, still following up on shit. I think the problem is you're not marketing yourself. You need more people to see your commission thing. I don't know. I don't know anything about that because, like, look at me. I'm trying. I'm trying to be noticed, and we got what, like, five people here, maybe. I guess it's a lot. I don't know. A lot to some people. Quicksand. This place is full of deadly pitfalls. Watch your step. You are, you're even advertising stuff. True. But you know, sometimes you just gotta wait for the for the right crowd to roll in. Quicksand! This place is full of deadly pitfalls. Sorry, Watch it's already three, so I'm kind of kinda of wearing down a bit. Where's he going? The jungles of okay. Strong Borneo have many poisonous and man eating plants. I better keep my distance. Clearly, this is meant to scare people off, but for dangerous, it's just an invitation to get to the bottom of what's behind this sign. Clearly, this is meant to scare people off. Strong Borneo, population dang dangerous. Danger. I, I just instinctively want to say dangerous because of how many no times way, it gets said here. River Quest boat is gonna make it back up that waterfall. I better leave it here. Any luck finding that formula? Not yet. Sure, there are better artists out there. Well, here's the thing: there's always going to be someone better. You can't let that affect you. If I didn't, sh if I stopped streaming, if I my mindset with streaming was, well, why bother? There's better people than me streaming out there. Then you know I would never stream. You would never see me stream. Right now, it is three in the morning, and I'm sure. There are people, there are partners. Right now... Partners. Shut up and pass me. Let's see, right now, Dorb from uh, from Vine Sauce. He's playing Hi-Fi Rush. 100 people watching him. Casey Mangelo, voice actor. Talked about them a ton. Playing Goldeneye. 52 people watching. Even, even some other people on my team. Like 18, 13, 9. It's, it's just how it is. If I let those people... 
discourage me just because they're good at streaming and they get people watching them, you know, then I would never stream ever. <laughs> there will always be someone better than you. Exactly. What am I supposed to be looking for here? The formula? The Krabby Patty formula? Why do you just default? Okay, so he's defaulting to that plant. I can't actually leave this spot. That's quicksand, man. I'm not sticking any of my stuff in there. That's quick. That's quick. That's quick. That serum's gotta be hidden around here somewhere in these jungles. There's no way this old. Just do the thing that you like. Yep. I mean, don't get me wrong. I beat my I beat myself up more than I should over the stream thing. The jungle is more more than I more than I let on, and that's saying something because I I'm not too quiet about the being disappointed with my streams. Have many poisonous and man-eating plants. But that's you know it is what distance. it is. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go into that right now. So there's no. What am I supposed to do here? The stop sign. Clearly, this is meant to scare people off, but for dangerous, it's just a. Oh, get to the bottom. Of what's behind the sign? Uh, shoot it. Here we go. Aha! A secret area for stashing valuable. There's a low percentage items. of customers, in like, say, you're an art example, mage, and I swear upon the art uh, mage oath, we can hear you great. Forest formula. I mean, sure, whatever keeps you going. Draw because you want to. Mm, I think I see something. Mm, I can't quite reach. Yes, I'm talking over the dialogue now. I don't want to do that. Let me try. My arms are longer and stickier. No way, it's a trap. Look out, Ronaldo! It's a Western Lowland Grizzly Sharkosaurus bot, and it's holding a shark. Help! I'm trapped. You know what my favorite season is, Ronaldo? I don't know, December Wayne? I'm kind of busy here. How are you doing down there, Ronaldo? Well, I gotta tell you, I'd be much more relaxed if you'd do something about that thing that's about to chew off my face. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How you doing down there? What? Oh, yeah. It's supposed to be like Johnny Quest. I mean, it's supposed to be like a, like a buddy cop movie. With action scenes, I don't know. Uh oh, jam! Good thing there are two sides to every gun. Take that! And this! Oh, is that your liver? Well, here's my fist! And a boot to the head! And one for Jenny and the whip! Wow, that was a reference I wasn't expecting to be made. What happened to the monster? Oh, he's history! And biology! And a little metal shop! Did you get the formula? Oh no! I must have grabbed it too hard! It's turned to dust! Ronaldo! Not to worry! I know someone who can help! But you're not gonna like it! You know me! That's right! Deranged rocket scientist Professor Experimento! I'm guessing that's strong sad. That whack job got me kicked out of the space program back in 83! Well, he's made a lot of scientific-ish advances in formula reproduction. He could probably recreate Cutesy Button's rainforest formula if you bring him some of this powdery goop. Powdery goop? How are you feeling, Renato? Better now that you took care of that Berzo Sharko Robosaurus bottomajig. It's what I do. This feels a lot mm, more linear. Secret lab won't be so secret from me after I add it to my GSPTK. Out and spit takes. I wonder what those are. Three of fourteen. Oh no, it's it's pom pom. Okay. Freeze, scumbag! Put down the science and get up against the wall. Hey, hey, hey! Come on now, just everybody relax. We're here for a favor. 
You gotta be more careful, Ronaldo. These things could have punctured your melon, and you only have two weeks till retirement. Oh, you know you can squeeze my head to tell if I'm fresh. I did not need to know that. Probably start listening when people say sour rest. Yeah, no, you should. If you're pushing yourself too hard and you feel tired, you shouldn't keep going. I've always wanted to simulate going into space. Let's give this heap a test drive. S to start, Q to quit. Oh god, dodge steel circus treats with the arrow keys. These are indestructible. Launch a rescue bubble with the Z key. Save the performers. Shoot space lasers with the X key. Destroy the evil clowns, okay. Dodging! Invasive maneuvers! Ha ha! Oh, crap sickles! Wow, this is a... Uh... It's Circus Charlie, but with guns. Oops! Rescue! Wow, this is actually very difficult. No! Bruce. How do you... Oh, I probably have to go up. Missed me! Oh, the entire screen shook from that. Wow, this game is uh, very, very rough. So let's move with the... It's... Move with these. Save with. Okay. Shoot. Uh, save. Are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? Saving lives and kissing wives. Dangerous. Move, move, move. Okay, I see how it works now. Pluto. Gotcha. Dodging. There we go. I, f I figured it out now. Fire! Whoa! No, the space rocks are supposed to uh, dodge. You you could see what direction they're coming from. You have to dodge away from them. Move, move, move. Z will rescue someone, and X will destroy the clown. I want to save everyone but the clown. Invasive maneuvers. Ooh, it's Uranus. Nice. Kill Sun, please. <laughs> like, kill Sun Goku? I'm gonna get Android 16 in here. Saving lives and kissing wives. Dangerous. Breaking hearts and blasting farts. Rescue! No! That gets me minus Miss points. Me. Um, are these supposed to be some Fuck. kind of bubble lasers? There we go. Missed me! Invasive maneuvers! Gotcha. Dodging. Truly riveting gameplay. You're 
Welcome, spaceman. Whoops. The bear and the tutu makes me think of the bear from Harvey Birdman. Move, move, move. It looks like the same Whoa. bear. Saved ya. Loving husbands and avoiding contrapants. Take that, dirtbag! Bloop! No! I killed the bear. You're welcome, spaceman! Invasive maneuvers! Bear noises while appearing randomly, yeah. There's a Harvey Birdman game that plays like Ace Attorney. I've, I've played it before. Maybe that'll be a good idea for a stream one day. We're almost done. We're at Mars. Pew, 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 pew. Out of my way. Gotcha. Take that, dirtbag! Throosh! Maybe some uh, characters to rescue would be nice. Whoa! Missed me! Fire! Good characters? Gotcha! Dodging! Rescue! Saved ya! Um, are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? I got really lucky there. Earth! E-Earth! <laughs> Shoot the clown, no! Gotcha! Saved ya! You're welcome, spaceman! My hands are cramping up. Bruce! Missed me! Invasive maneuvers! Um, are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? Shit. One more to go. Not you. Move, move, move! Not you. You. Venice. Venice, Italy. Kissing wives, dangerous. Rescue! You lose my concentration. <laughs> I want to see if there's an end to this. Saved ya! Invasive maneuvers! Spaceman! Bruce. 
Ow! Why that hit me? me. Take that, dirt bag! Whoa! Mercury. Rescued. Ha -ha! Out of my way. Oh, that yep. can't be good. Mayday, mayday. Move, move, move. Um, are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? Nice, got a lot there. Move, move, move! Saving lives and kissing wives, dangerous. You're welcome, spaceman. Bruce. Whoa! Saved ya! Missed me! Welcome back! The sun! This person who loves clowns, hell yeah, save the clowns, yeah. No, the clowns are bad, I'm killing them. Fire! I do enjoy clowns, but not, not here. Saving lives and kissing wives, dangerous. Sag, yeah. Pew, 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 pew. Um, are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? Gotcha! Rescue! Um, are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? Dodging? I don't care. I'm just gonna absorb everything. Saved ya! Black hole. Oh, we're not done. Saving lives and kissing wives, dangerous. Gotcha! Fire! I care if it's minus 50, I'm just taking the loss at this point. Oh, I pressed up! You're welcome, spaceman! Rescue! Um, are these supposed to be some kind of bubble lasers? And simulation? Aww. I want to keep trekking the stars. Oh, man. I wonder, uh... Oh, I got green. Cool. Well, that counts as clearing it. Unfunny sidekick. Gonna absorb this, everything. This nunchuck gun says I mean business. And I don't mean investment banking. I mean the other kind of business you do with the firearm. Just so you know. Now is no time for violence. Just kidding. Any time is a good time for violence. But I do have more important things to do right now. Uh, boxing gloves on chalkboards don't have quite the cringe effect as fingernails. It's pretty based, not cringe. Fine! I didn't want to touch your stupid science any dang way! Yeah, it was some kind of space circus. At least that was the premise. Ruby powered rocket. Is that a ring pop on there? Powered rocket. I ordered one of these from the back of a comic book once. Only the ruby was plastic. And the rocket was a toilet paper roll. And the comic book was a napkin. The performers. Ah, the pioneers of space travel. 
lovingly commemorated here in the pages of this official spaceflight document. These brave astronauts are an inspiration to us all. What'd that say? Meet the musty smelling performance of the galactic surface. Ringmaster Glork juggling Jimbo. Rocco the Grizzly and Eugene. Check out that rocket over there. Yeah, looks pretty sweet. Of course it does. That's because he totally stole my design. Remember that one time I had that dream about a spaceship that runs on tomato soup? I told you all about it. I still say Professor Experimento copied my idea for a rocket ship. Yeah, probably. <sighs> Who cares if mine didn't actually fly? It had panache. Oh, I love panache. I had some for dessert last night. Space furry con. Huh? I, I think that's been a theme in a furry con before. Check out that rocket over there. Yeah, looks pr Of course it does on... Once we get the formula back to cutesy buttons, we're gonna be rich, and you can finally retire in style. I think I'm gonna buy me that collection of matching spandex turbans I've had my eye on. Turbans? Okay, well, maybe you can just retire. Once we get the formula... Uh, what are Experimento's credentials again? He's got a PhD in Formulology, an MHD in Rocket Launchology, and a TBD in Advanced Predictability. Well, his ologies check out, but I still say he's sorely lacking in the ography and oolness departments. You have a PhD in horny? Yeah, I know. Here, here's your diploma. Okay, can't move any closer. I gotta say, you turned out okay, Experimento. PhD in Bonk. At least bonk. you're not still trying to contact hot alien races in the hopes of interplanetary prom dates. All right, that was me. I gotta say, you're on a... So, I hear you've become an expert in making formulas, huh? So, I guess your area of expertise is in baby formula. Right? Because you're a baby? Burn. Oh, come on. You totally set me up for now. <laughs> I, I'm so... So, I hear you've become an expert. Oh. Not so on my A-game today. Kind of expert on formulas now, huh? Okay, mister, you can't take a plastic bag full of scorpions into space. What's it gonna take to get you to recreate this top secret formula for me? Somebody stole a disk of important launch codes for your rocket and you want me to get them back? That sounds fair. You get me my formula and I'll find your disk. Typing up paper right now and I kind of bond Bailey see how I feel about AI art and it's literally just a bunch of angry spicy words. Hey, what no. AI art's on? terrible. Ronaldo, what is he bubbling about? It's worth getting He's passionate ingredients. over right now. He's figuring out what he needs to make the formula. Bubbly drink. A bubbly liquid. A flower from the rare stick and knee tree, and some yellow hair? Nice job. Looks like we'll be scouring the streets of Brain Blow City tonight. That sure is some kind of ruby powered rocket. Yeah? Can it fly? Somebody broke in here and stole your computer disk of highly important launch codes? I was about That's to make this as professional wrong, also internally getting mad. I mean, remember, you could state your intention clearly without coming off aggressive. That's the key to good writing. Fine! I didn't want to... Or something, I don't know. The Hell formula I ingredients are... A bubbly liquid, a flower from the rare stick -knee tree, and some yellow hair. It's what plants crave. Got electrolytes. It's got what plants crave. Hey, look at that. I happen to have a carbonated liquid right here. Man, I'm good. I know it looks delicious, but it tastes more like one of Ronaldo's old gym socks. And trust me, 
You do not want to know how I became familiar with that particular taste sensation. Okay, you Sweet got in the your nation, bowl drink. Now make what the formula make. Ing. It doesn't have the capacity to add I to art, if you know what I mean. Yeah, exactly. We're doing wordplay. We played a whole game. We played two old games based on that. Hey, it isn't really the problem. People who take advantage of it. Yeah, I mean, here's the thing. AI tools have been used in art for a while. The problem is that it shouldn't be used to replicate entire fucking drawings. No rave switch in this episode. There's nothing on him I want to cut, except maybe a deal for 80% of the profits. There's the ruby. Whoa, check out the size of that ruby. Mm, that's making me hungry for a push Don't pop. Worry, nah, ring pop. Steal it. I'm just saying, pretty big ruby. That's way too thick for these scissors. No way. Uh, my workplace manual describes that as inappropriate behavior. Despite that, I'm still not giving him my plant. Just realized it hasn't snowed once this year yet. Four emails. Oh. I keep getting messages from DHL because of the, uh... Because of the... 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 the, the Inteleon plush. Uh, my workplace manual... Yes, exactly, Sour Cream. You 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 got it perfectly. Like, that's just you know, it's the wrong attitude to have. Rainbow City isn't the default location in my travel log. I better add it now. I'm guessing that's just another part of the because that's the wall. That's the brick wall Rainbow right there. Yep. Rainbow City, a town as hard as steel and twice as gray. She's like a fine lady type. Treat her right, and she'll make you cupcakes shaped like cold ones. But treat her wrong, and she'll kick you in the knees, step on your face with a stiletto heel, take your wallet, and totally ruin your credit score. Oh! Yeah, your woman scares me. I'll just wait here by the wall where it's safe. You go on ahead. I need to check here? No. Cutesy Buttons better be ready to fork over several sacks of cash for rescuing her and getting her rainforest formula. Rescuing her? I'd just be happy to get a hug from Marzipan. What? What? I said nothing. Cutesy Buttons better... Hey, what? Cutesy... Well, it's not about the money for me, Dangerous. I just want to be a hero one more time before I retire. You'll always be a hero to me, Ronaldo. Uh -huh. Uncomfortable. Cutesy buttons. But don't worry. She's an environmental conservationist. I'm sure she's loaded. Cutesy buttons. I just be hip. What? Cutesy buttons. Well, it's not about the money. You'll always. Uh, hey, there was something else there that I didn't. Don't worry. Come on. Cutesy. If she doesn't, we'll frame her for a bank robbery and send her up the river. Nice. That's kind of harsh. Cutesy buttons. Well, it's not about the money. Oh, it's randomized. I think that's why. I heard a rumor that Brainblow City is the only place left in the world where the rare stick a knee tree can be found. That's fantastic! That means we won't have to travel the globe for this case like we did back in 91, when we were on the trail of the two-legged man! Yeah, I guess I really didn't think that one through too carefully. You know, this isn't the first time I've come in contact with the rare stick and knee flower. Are you talking about that girl in Paris again? You gotta let that go! After all, you ended up leaving her stranded in Cairo. You don't think she's still mad about that? Keep your head in the game, danger -esk. I heard a rumor that brain blows. Hey, like it, man. Yeah. All right. 
I've been doing this chapter for about an hour. It's 3.30 in the morning, and it looks like the discussion in chat is getting a little... a little heated here. Like, you all seem to be in agreement, which is great. And I absolutely agree with all you two. The AAR art is, uh... The AR issue is is not good, and that we need to uh, we need to really evaluate it and think things through. Uh, but due to both the timing and the time, and also the time and also you know the progress we've made here, I think this is probably a good place to cut it for tonight. Uh, wow, I'm still missing a ton of stuff. I wonder if this just becomes more open ended as we go along. Because right now it seems like we're really being like forced into a single tunnel here. Brain Blow City. You were done, you just needed that out there. Yeah, no, of course. Yeah, what's up, Sour Cream? S speak your mind before I start the ending spiel. Doggo butt, amazing. Incredible. Look, I'm gonna sh- on getting a stick and eat flower wouldn't be so easy. That deranged scientist talks like they grow on trees or something. Look, I'm going to show that to everyone watching this. Doggo butt in the chat, in the corner. It's there. Shit. Okay, there we go. Anyway, I'm going to I'm gonna close it out for tonight. Um, we are making good progress here. Um, tomorrow night, I'm going to try to stream. Uh, if I do, it will be... Again, I've mentioned this several times. Final Fantasy XIV, going to give that another stream. Gonna try to stream in 1080p, so if your devices are having trouble loading the stream, uh, remember that everyone on Twitch should now have that option to lower the stream quality. So just kick it down if it's if it's lagging a bit. Hopefully it doesn't cause issues with my computer. Again, the reason I'm doing this is because when I streamed FF14 last time at 720p, it just looked like total ass, and I did not want to like I don't want to stream like that again. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna try 1080p tomorrow. Um, this weekend, I mean, I'm going to, I don't know, because now I'm a little busy. I've got stuff to do Saturday. I might try to stream, though. We'll see. Maybe I'll start one of those two other games I've been thinking about. And if not, then probably Sunday. If I do start one of the games tomorrow, then Sunday I'll probably do more Strong Bad and finish this and then move on to the final chapter, which has the character that I know a few of you have been waiting for. Um, but yeah. That's going to be it from me. If you want to watch more streams, check out twitch.tv slash team slash wildabandon. Plenty of people streaming there right now. Um, yeah, there's not really anyone here. Actually, no, you know what? There's five people here. Let's let's raid someone. Let's give someone... Let's give someone the time of day and be nice. Because let me tell you, it feels what good. I quit, Commissioner. It feels good to, uh, to, to get a raid. So giving them is just as good. DJ Trav Gaming. I haven't seen them before. I will, uh, or, or have I? I don't know. Am I following them? Let me see here. No, I am not. All right, let's throw them a, let's throw them a, uh, a raid. Stick around and say hi to them. And otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow night. Take care. Once I find the thing I want to play to take us out here. Yeah, screw it.